Hi, this is BBHMM State Pool showing you how to set up your Roy wallet uh, using a ledger and setting, sending it from the Kraken Exchange. First, you're going to want to go to cardano.org, which is your safe source of information. Uh, go to individuals and click on your Roy wallet. Um, from there, you'll be able to download the version that you want. In this case, um, we have a Brave browser, which is a version of Chrome. Um, so we're clicking on Chrome and then it'll take you to the Chrome web store where you can gain access to the Yoroi wallet extension. Um, we're basically going to add that extension in and then you're going to be able to click on that Yoroi wallet on the top right of your screen. Um, as we go in here and now it's going to set up the wallet. You want to choose what language you use and then the terms of use. Uh, agree to that and then it will move on to what type of wallet you want. Uh, I chose advanced because I want the advanced capabilities. I'm not using it now so we're going to skip it and then confirm it for later. At this point we want to pick uh, the type of wallet which is a hardware wallet and our coin which is Cardano of course. Um, from here we pick the type of wallet now and that's section you can also use uh, treasure wallet but we chose ledger and then we move on what era and we're in the Shelly era so we want to click the share Shelly era wallet um, you connect your ledger up to your computer you want to make sure you have the latest firmware on there and the latest version of the Cardano app it's very important or it will not work properly so go ahead and connect your wallet. Um, you're going to pick if it's a Ledger Nano S or an X. In this case, we're using an X. And from here, it's going to ask you to verify these certain things on your Ledger. Um, go ahead and do that by clicking the top two buttons. Um, sometimes it makes you do it twice. Um, and so go ahead and do it twice after that's done. Then it's created that wallet, uh, your Roy wallet using a Ledger. And here you can see your wallet set up. Now from here you want to get your a receive address. So you want to be able to send coin to your address. Copy that and then go to the exchange or wherever you store your coin. Maybe it's in Daedalus. Um, here it's in Kraken Exchange. Um, go ahead and withdraw it and then it's going to ask you to put in a new address. Here we have to add the address, um, put in the description and the actual address is there it's going to make you verify uh, some things at this point in your email. So just follow the steps in the email and then um, you can go forward from there. Hit continue. Um, you may have to refresh the page, but then when your wallet appears, um, go ahead and check that. Make sure it is the same as the address that's shown in the receive there. Um, once it's been verified, go ahead and... Um, put the amount that you want to send over and review the withdrawal. Um, we're ready to confirm the address and then we confirm the withdrawal. Um, this will take a few seconds to actually send over. You can view it on the chain or you can look here in your, your Roy wallet. It should take you know, a few seconds, maybe a minute or so, um, but it'll be in here. It shows the actual transaction um, below and here since you sent over that coin uh, thank you for watching my video and let me know if you have any questions